hello uh, in this video i'm going to show you how you can download sentinel 2a dataset in our previous video we have seen how you can download landsat satellite image and sentinel 1c level 1 dataset but in this video we are going to see how one can download Sentinel 2A dataset. The difference between Sentinel 2A dataset and Sentinel 1C level 1 dataset is this dataset is already atmospherically corrected. So you don't need to do some pre processing operation over this Sentinel 2A dataset. It's already uh, radiometrically corrected, atmospherically corrected, and topographically corrected. So that is the unique thing about this dataset. So if you uh, download this dataset, no need of pre-processing of the dataset. You just directly go to uh, classification and information extraction. So this is uh, why uh, we usually say downloading Sentinel 2A dataset is very important. So now let's go directly to the site. So in, in the slide, I have already uh, given you the, the web page where you can download Sentinel 2A uh, dataset. Just type that and say enter. It will direct you to uh, the download site. So the first thing that you need to do is you have to create the login account. So you can create it for free. So it will take you some, you know, 30 seconds or one minute to have that uh, account. Once you log in, for example, I have already created uh, account, so I have to uh, say login. It says login successful. And the next thing that I need to do is go to my uh, search area or area of interest. Uh, so my study area probably uh, is uh, around uh, Bahardar area, for example, I want to download the satellite image of, uh, of this area, which is topographically corrected. So I have to create some kind of a region of interest. Once I create this region of interest, or once I select my area of interest, I go to uh, this button. So I click this uh, and I go directly to uh, the mission. There are different Sentinel missions, Sentinel 1, 2, 3. So my interest is to download uh, Sentinel 2 mission. And one of the most important, you know, information that I have to specify is the product type. I only need for the timing Sentinel 2A dataset. And sometimes you'll be required, you know, to make it specific by, you know, specifying this Sentinel 2A dataset. I don't need to be the dataset because most of the time, if your internet connection is poor, it will take some time until it, you know, it uh, show you all of the required or of the selected data sets. So in order to reduce that effect, you have to make it very specific. And it may not be necessary to specify the crowd cover or if you like, you can specify by saying zero to uh, 10%, zero to 15% something like that. Once I finish, I've not yet finished specifying my requirement. The one of the most important uh, requirements should be the sensing time. You know, most of the time here in Ethiopia, we download a dry season image. So I have to uh, specify that time. So January image, I make it January from the 1st of January until uh, the end of January. So um, I, I should make this January 31st. That's it. So I only need for the time being, uh, you know, to to see whether there is 
um, the required data or not, a one minute time could be sufficient. So once I finish specifying, specifying the sensing period, specifying the product type and specifying the satellite platform could be enough. Once you finish that, you click on this search button. So you need to be patient until it brings you uh, the search result. Okay, now we have uh, our search result data. You know, it resulted in displaying 12 products. So let's have a look at which one is uh, the data that we uh, require, you know, for this specific area, for this specific area. So is it the one? I can see that there is a uh, full of cloud in here. And if this is so, there are some clouds in the lake the lake area. If I click on this, it's going uh, to be very small area. So if I uh, click this one, I can also have a look at this uh, uh, image by clicking this I button. So probably this uh, could be a very good uh, satellite image. I do have uh, information about the, the satellite image, the product type, the date, it is January 17 image at, you know, very close to uh, 8 a.m. It was captured. So the different instruments, the platform is already mentioned. So if you are satisfied with this data, you just click on uh, this. and it will start uh, to download automatically. So as you can see, it is it's downloading now. So you need to uh, wait for the timing. We don't need this. We have finished how to download uh, Sentinel 2A, Sentinel 2A data set, which is atmospherically, topographically, and radiometrically corrected data set from Copernicus Open Access Hub.